Hello guys, I hope you are all fine. Today we are here to discuss about transfer reactants. It is the total reaction between the internal EMF of a generator and internal bus bar voltage. The EMF between the between these two, the total reactance between these two is, is known as transfer reactance. Whereas here the transfer reactance is denoted by X. We already know we already know that P equals to modulus of V1 into modulus of V2 by X into sin delta. Here there will be two voltage sources now V1 V2 in this uh, in this. So we will take V1 into V2 modulus of V1 into V2. So here if you observe here this P is inversely proportional to X. So during steady state condition delta e equals to 90 degrees we already discussed about this uh, how it will be 90 degrees we already discussed about uh, this in the previous video whereas the p max will be modulus of v1 into modulus of v2 by x into sin 90 degrees here the sin 90 degrees is 1 which is equals to modulus of v1 into modulus of v2 by x here the stability can be increased by decreasing the x by decreasing the transient reactance we can increase the stability then that here the transfer reactance can be we should decrease this transfer reactance this is not improved guys we should decrease this transfer reactance by increasing the parallel line between your transmission points whereas by using bundle conductors whereas by using series capacitance in the line we can by using these three process we can decrease the transfer reactance this is not improved this is a decrease i hope you understand guys thank you